It's time for a quick and dirty review of the RSI Mantis. First thing you notice is that it's a pretty good looking ship, especially that mostly glass cockpit. The button to get in is so small I actually missed it the first time and a friend of mine found it faster. But it's a tiny little elevator that oh just falls short of the actual landing pad, which is kind of lame. But it's cool that you get to take an elevator up. The inside is incredibly utilitarian. There is a bed, uh, a mechanism in the back that I believe is the thing that rips people out of quantum. And that's pretty much it. The ship is the only ship that can actually do that, rip people out of quantum, which makes it pretty cool. It's fast, it speeds up quickly, it slows down quickly. It has one of my favorite uh, heads up displays in the game. Um, and it's, it's just got a different font and line quality than many of the other ones that I find way more pleasing. And of course, uh, the landing gear animation is cool. It can go faster than on quite a few ships and not get in the red. It unfortunately does not have very exciting weapons or very exciting shields. Uh, you can take down the smaller targets, not with that any really problem, but the weapons shoot really slowly and don't have that high of DPS anyway. The shields are average. Uh, Combat-wise, I believe it is worse, slightly worse than the Titan, but better than the Mustang. So although you can rip people out of quantum travel, you're probably going to be want you're probably going to want to be careful as to who you are ripping out of quantum travel. It only has four missiles, which is kind of a bummer. Um, this is a clip of me toasting a, a weak AI in a fight, but you can see again, the, like I said, the weapons shoot really slowly, um, which for some of you I know, myself included, is kind of annoying because uh, you have to be more intentional when you shoot. Um, it maneuvers nicely, which is fun, and I know you can upgrade the weapons and shields. This is just the stock. They're really stressful to use, and four missiles is not very many. If you're looking for an early game fighter, I don't recommend it, but if you're trying to do some of those expensive uh, player bounties with friends, this ship would be an incredible addition to the squad um, to rip them out of orbit i mean out of quantum and then you know have the bigger ships abuse them also on the subject of quantum it doesn't have that much fuel it can only make it like halfway across the verse before having to refuel which is kind of annoying if you're doing solo stuff um it's a cool ship overall but if you're looking for a one and only ship it's not your person oh and there's no cargo but you could fit boxes up that elevator if you're trying to do missions that aren't combat.